seminal fluid analysis. This test is performed if you think you might have a fertility problem or after a vasectomy to determine if the operation was successful. The sample required is a semen sample collected in a sterile, wide-mouthed container provided by the lab, often collected on site. Two separate collections on two separate days may be required. You should refrain from having sex or masturbation for three to five days before sample collection. A complete semen analysis measures and evaluates the quantity and quality of the fluid released during ejaculation. It also evaluates the microscopic moving cells called sperm. Semen is a viscous, whitish liquid that contains sperm and the products from several glands. It is fairly thick at ejaculation, but thins out or liquefies within 10 to 30 minutes. Each semen sample is between 1.5 and 5.5 millimeters of fluid, containing at least 20 million sperm per millimeter. A typical semen analysis measures volume and viscosity of semen, seminal fluid coagulation and liquefaction, semen acidity, its pH, sperm concentration and density, sperm count and its motility, ability to move, number or percent of normal and abnormal, defective, sperm in terms of size and shape, morphology, fructose amount, a sugar in semen that gives energy to sperm, number of white blood cells, if present. When a semen analysis shows abnormal findings, the test is repeated at intervals as determined by the healthcare practitioner. Several factors can affect the sperm count or other semen analysis values, including use of alcohol, tobacco, caffeine, many recreational and prescription drugs, as in cimetidine, and some herbal medicines, such as St. John's wort. Al Borg Medical Laboratories. Watch more at our YouTube channel.